if you are a white woman and you are dating in love with married to a black man I want you to listen up um, there are certain things that you need to know and I don't think this is spoke about enough but um, the most dangerous thing in this world are the tears of a white woman and if you truly love the black man that you are with you need to know that you need to have his back and protect him at all costs including protecting him from yourself and what do I mean by that my son was dating a white woman my son is biracial um, they got into an argument in public and she started to scream and cry and my son immediately left the scene she was outraged she couldn't believe my son left my son left because my son knew that if he stayed there and this woman was crying and screaming at him a black man there was not going to be any questions asked he was going to be thrown to the ground he was going to go to jail it was not going to be any questions asked because this white woman was crying and screaming about him now I'm sure this female may have been hurt her feelings was hurt she was a little emotional however when you are dating a black man and you're a white woman, you need to understand that sometimes your fucking feelings and your emotions have to take a fucking back seat to not cause harm to the person you are dating, that you love, that you are married to. And I'm not telling you that if you are truly in fucking danger not to get help. But if you're just emotional, you're just pissed off, and you want to scream and hoop and holler, in public is not the time. Because that can turn out very deadly for the black man that you claim to love so much. Whether you realize it or not. If you were just dating a white man and you were yelling, nobody would really pay any attention to that shit. But when people see a white woman and a black man and you're screaming, all hell will break loose. Because when white women cry, everybody responds. Even if the shit is stupid, even if it's frivolous, even if it's a lie. The most deadliest thing in this world are white women tears. I have said this time and time again. And I learned this very, very early in life. I grew up in the projects. I was raised by two wonderful black women that helped my mother raise me. So I know what I have witnessed, what I have experienced, and I know for a fact of what I speak. I learned very early in life that I could be a voice for my friends and my family because people would listen to me far more than they would listen to them. And if you listen to anything I have ever said to you on this app, if you are a white woman and you are dating a black man, you are in love with a black man, you are married to a black man, you need to know that you need to have his back and protect him at all costs, even if it is protecting him from you. Handle that shit at home if you